Good morning. Today is Sunday. I just finished watching church. I was bedside Baptist today again. I need to go to church, like get up and physically go. These last few weeks, it's been a lot going on as far as work, a little bit of wedding planning and things like that. But I was vlogging, but nothing was coming together. So I was just like, I'm going to start fresh. Today's Sunday. I have a lot to do. My hair is still straight but I need to wash it because it's starting to itch. It's been straight now for like three weeks and it's held up very well. They also need to press me on some nails and I wanted to record like an actual review of this new deep conditioner that I got. But yeah, I had to take a break from social media this week. And I wouldn't, it wasn't like a real break, but it was just, I have the time set for like how long I could be on social media. And whenever the hour would be gone, I would just get off. There were some days I kind of slipped up and was on it a little bit longer, but I cut back on social media, but I also got back into reading my Bible and, you know, taking notes from what I read. I was also in this discipleship group called Queen Esther at my church. And one of the things the director always would say is you have to go to love to get love to get, wait, you have to go to love to get love to give love and I just needed that like I needed the love from God like I had to go to God to get love from him so that I can get the love to give it to other people so I'm about to go find me something to eat I've really been wanting I've really really been wanting a double cheeseburger from McDonald's, french fries, a McFlurry, and a Sprite. I haven't had McDonald's in over 10 years, but I've been craving that. I wanted to show you all some new products I got. So y'all saw me trying on some stuff from Shein, but I just felt like I needed to wash it. It didn't stink or anything. I just needed to wash it. And I'm a little disappointed in like one of the jackets that I got because I feel like it looks a little bit different online than with me trying it on, but I still like it overall. It just doesn't button. That was like the only thing. But I also got some stuff from Ulta. I got me some more press on nails. I got, oh no, I got these from CVS actually. These are like gray gel press on nails and they are in the long length. And I also got these two medium length nails. They're like in a coffin shape. These press on nails, there's no glue needed. And I tested it out two weeks ago and I was like, if this works, then I'm gonna buy some more. I tried these when I was out in Hampton and they lasted for, and I even pressed them on in the car driving down to Hampton. It lasted for five days. I think by the time the, the following Friday hit, I was just ready to pop them off anyways to you know give my nails a break or just change them. And I also got these from Ulta as well. Now these, you can use glue and I think they have a sticker on them as well, but I think I'm gonna save these for like, something real nice, something real nice. One of my items I wanted to show y'all spilled all over me. Okay, so just give me a moment. So this was one of the last nails that I got, but I'm gonna save these for like spring, summertime. I just thought they were super cute. So that's the nails. And I also wanted to show you all this new body wash that I got. It's by Nude Sugar. It's actually um, Tony Braxton's skincare line. So if this bottle, this top part twists like that, but it's overflowing. I don't know how this is happening, but um, it literally spilled all over my pants. But that just irritated me. These are the other products that I have from Nude Sugar. And then they smell really good too. I'm so irritated. I've always wanted to do this close shot of 
straight hair, revert, reverting back to really tightly coiled curled hair. And I tried it before, but I feel like I didn't get the detail that I wanted. So now I'm gonna try it again. Um, oh yeah, maybe that might work. So I'm gonna try it again, and I want this to be like a TikTok or Instagram or something like that. So I will see y'all later. Jasmine. What? What are you doing? Mm -hmm. Any help? I think I got it. Are you recording? Mm-hmm. Oh. You wanna be in a YouTube video? Hmm? You wanna be in a YouTube video? Do what? You wanna be in your YouTube video? Oh, <laughs> maybe. Mm. Depending on how this part comes out. <clears throat> Oh, where did you buy that from? I actually got it for free. Oh, okay. Why? Good, I'm glad you didn't buy that. Oh, you don't like it? No. <laughs> you like you about to cook pancakes. Going to do my nails. I've been waiting to do this part all day. This is what I was looking forward to. Pressing my nails on. Good morning, y'all. It's the next morning and I'm about to go for a quick little jog. And I'm proud of me because I think it was last week I ran for 20 minutes straight. And that's a big deal for me because when I first started, I couldn't get, I don't think I could run past like five minutes. Um, now I just have to figure out which run I want to do, but I wanted to come on to like show people that when I don't drink enough water or I eat too much sodium the previous day, my ring, my finger, I, I noticed that my fingers swell. And I think I noticed that because now my ring, like sometimes I can, it's not easy to pull off, but it's easier to pull off. But when my fingers swell or I don't drink enough water, my ring definitely lets, definitely lets me know, like, girl, get it together. So, so the run is done. It's a work from home day today. So I got to log in and also stretch out. And one thing I do like about running is I don't have to think about anything. I just got to put one foot in front of the other. Last week, I was able to run the full 20 minutes straight. But today, um, I felt like I needed to back off a little bit, and I do. So how I reset while I'm running is if I feel like I need a break, I just walk and count to 30 and then pick back up. And I don't know what it is about that 30 seconds, but it really helps. So that was my 28th run and I started running in the summer and like July. It's October now and I can't believe I ran 28 times on purpose. Alright, so I just got to make a few returns but I wanted to come on because I was, I think I like my nails better today than I liked them yesterday. I've been thinking about going back vegetarian. For one, I feel like the meat is not tasting the same. And I have I was vegetarian maybe for like a year and I was doing really good. But now I wanna go back. But the thing about it is I've been craving a double cheeseburger from McDonald's. And I have not had McDonald's in so long. But I want that. But it's something I've been seriously considering after I get my McDouble take my hair out to show y'all the result and then that's when I was going to end this vlog but I'm just gonna have to wait until tomorrow to show y'all but this is how I've been wearing it well I actually had on another headband for work but then I just took the headband off and put this on so I could go run a few errands but I'll see y'all tomorrow